3K, baby! Yeah! G'day, you spexy people. My name's Kane, and welcome to the Q&A. Today, we're just going to be answering your questions, and without further ado, let's get in. Favorite car? Couple up on the screen. I can't name them all. Opinion on protogens? Fucking love them. Are expensive toasters worth the money? Whoa. Have you ever asked a protogen what their favorite flavor of Windex is? Hold on. Have now. Why do I have so many unimportant questions? Every question is important and has their own uniqueness. Is that a word? What is an acceptable length of a wise man's beard? Uh, there. How will you react to this many random and strange questions? Just, just reverse it. <laughs> I have a question. My friends are at war on what's the better color, blue or orange. You clearly like both, so what do you think? I can't choose between them. Favorite alcohol beverage at the moment? All of them. How did you find out you were gay? We don't talk about that. Are there any YouTubers you would like to collab with? Uh, there is, but I'm too scared to reach out. What was your favorite Omegle reaction so far? Hmm. I'll throw a couple up on the screen. Hello. What the fuck? What's up? Hello. How's it you going? fucking faggot. Oh yes, my I... god, you're a fucking faggot. I am a faggot, yes. I have a boyfriend, I'm gay, yes. I am a faggot, yep. Tell you're me. such a fucking faggot. I fucking love you. Oh my him. god. You are amazing. Keep being amazing. You're, you're Keep a fucking faggot. I love you. Dave, Thank you. <clears throat> Hello. Ooh. Uh, I was gonna say whip it out, bro. <laughs> Hello. Learn economics or suck my dick. Boom. Okay. This uh, is economics. I will I shove I'm, it in your face. I'm gonna, I'm this gonna is choose page 732. Okay. On page 732, it's. <laughs> I'll let him speak. Can I choose the second say? option? What's your set? <laughs> <laughs> yeah! How did you start YouTube and why did you start? Um, I guess. I don't know. I wanted to start making content when I was like 11, but couldn't because I was 11. And I guess I just started because, I don't know, I just wanted to make people happy with the content I did. And um, yeah, that that's pretty much all. 1 to 10, how furry are you? Uh, this much. <laughs> if you've got this much VR gear, you're pra basically a furry. Or a professional VR player. Oh god, I gotta put it this way now. Do you like board slash card games? If so, what are your favorites? Hmm. Okay, Jenga is one of them. Uh, so board games, not tabletop games. Oh wait, would Jenga count as tabletop? Fuck. It's a mixed bag. It depends, really. It really depends. But I can't really name off the top of my head. Because I haven't played them in a while. Unless uh, spin the bottle counts. Being that you use Amigle a fair amount for your videos, is there any changes or improvements that you could make to the site? There is actually no improvements or changes I would make because Omegle is Omegle, okay? I would not change the way it is now. It is pretty much, is like, they've peaked. They can't improve it anymore. What really got you into wanting to make VR and VR chat Omegle? Well, actually, what really got me into it was actually, it just happened really, because if you go back and look at some of my old content, you would know that this, that like doing this was never, like never the plan. And basically what ended up happening, happening was I watched Mini Keen's video. I don't know if I'm saying that name right. Mini Keen, Mini, whatever. Um, and I watched these Omegle videos, and I thought, that's fucking sick. So I decided to load up uh, my VR one day, go through VR chat, and try and find an avatar that was close to mine, or because like I did not know how to do like upload my own custom avatars. So I tried to find one that was as close to mine as possible, um, and I, I ended up succeeding on that. I got I really fucking lucked out on that uh because a couple a couple years ago i uh, designed kane 
and then when I came into VR chat, I ran into one of Spaggy's models in Furhub, and with that, I just used that until I was able to make my own custom, and oh well, the rest is history. What inspired you to become a YouTuber, Jacksepticeye? I have a question. Why did you choose a kangaroo fursona? It's not because I'm Australian, okay? I do have to say that. Um, kangaroos fascinated me, and I always... Sorry. Um, I always really liked the way, like, that kangaroos looked. So, yeah, fascinated. And I thought, well, I like kangaroos, therefore I'm a kangaroo. And uh, the rest is history. <laughs> What's your favourite thing about the furry fandom? Yif. I'm joking. Um, favourite thing? Uh, the community. Definitely the community. Is it okay to draw your fursona? Fucking definitely. Go ahead. I absolutely love fan art. There's actually a channel in my uh, Discord server called Fan Art where you can upload that. And um, I check it every day. So, uh... Yeah, if you if you want to draw fan art, you can go put it on the Discord server and I will actually do a community post showing it off, giving you a shout out after you do that. And yeah. What's it like being in what's it like to what's it like what's it like in Australia? I'm having a stroke up here. <laughs> uh what's it like in Australia? Okay, um Hmm. Hot. What did your parents think of you being a furry? And would you get a suit if I could? Okay, I'm gonna answer these two questions in one go. I was talking to my dad about getting a fursuit and he said yes, and he's gonna help me probably. Who inspired you to become a fairy? I don't like become a furry or a fairy as in gay. Um one of my friends from school. <laughs> that, that, that actually answers both of my questions. <laughs> both of the questions. <laughs> What's your favorite video game minus Subnautica? Okay, um, favorite video game for me would probably be... What is going on? What, what's my computer doing? Okay, if you didn't- if you couldn't probably guess, it's, uh, Team Fortress 2. <laughs> What's your story of getting into YouTube? Um, well, I guess my story into getting YouTube was covered in the last video. Actually, no, my last video was that Omegle video. Fuck, uh, um, uh, th there's- Card. Card. <laughs> Is your fursona a modified version of the avatar available on Furhub? Uh, no. Yes and no, really. So, Kane was designed before I found the fur hub model, but I also used the fur hub texture and just recolored it a bit. Chevy or Ford? Well, for me in Australia, Chevy is actually Holden, so I guess Ford. I'm sorry, I'm a Ford man. You like cars? Yeah. How did you come out to your parents? Why is your fursona so cute? My- uh, I'm not cute. I'm not cute. I'm not- I'm not cute. <laughs> and how did I come out to my parents? Uh, actually, on a car trip. I was just like, hey, mom and dad, guess what? I'm not straight. <laughs> and that was just like, yeah, we guessed that. <laughs> and I'm just like, what? <laughs> how long have you been in the fandom? And is Kane your Sona, or did you get an an adoptable Sona? Uh, no, I uh, I actually designed Kane. I, I've been dreading this one. Okay. Uh, how many cans of Fosters do you consume on a regular sesh? I guess I just have to fucking do it, don't I? Um, the answer is normally zero, but I I, I assume you want me to drink it. 
I'm not drinking this. I'm I'm not. I'm just I'm not drinking it. Definitely not. Actually, I think it would be un-Australian if I didn't drink it out of a shoe. Fuck you, I'm doing a shoey. Fuck you, I'm doing a shoey. Fuck you, I shout buzzing on my way out, pouring over a shoe and put it to oh. my mouth. Fuck you, I'm doing a shoey. Hold on. I gotta finish it. Fuck you, I'm doing a shoey. Woo! Fuck it, I'm just gonna keep the beer on me. Looks like I pissed myself. What the fuck? <laughs> Oh, I got it on my mouse pad. No. Oh well. Ugh. Have to finish the can now, don't I? Ugh. What is your opinion on VR horror games? I love them. I'm actually going to do a a series of. I've had one can. What the fuck? I'm actually going to do a um a uh. A series on the exorcist soon. Do you like cats? If you don't, what's your favorite animal? I absolutely love cats. And I, 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 there's not really an animal that I don't like. Except for small spiders. The big ones are fine. But small spiders, I can lose track of them very easily and I fucking hate them. If YouTube never existed, what do you think you would be doing instead and why? Probably IT because that's the one I have most experience in. How did you find the furry fandom and what made you want to join in on it? Was this period of time significant to you? It wasn't significant, but I kind of just joined it as it went along. Um, that's pretty much it. What inspired you to start making videos on YouTube, and do you plan on trying to make this into a, f a career in the future? So, for the part where, like, what inspired me was entertaining people and, I don't know, giving people a community to join and, I don't know, meet other people through that community and do I plan on turning this into a career? Yes I do, um, but note I am not in it for the money, I'm here for the people. If I don't manage to make this into a career, I can always get another job and do YouTube on the side. What is your favourite place to visit or what is some place you'd really like to go? Okay, place I'd like to visit would probably be... Um... Ooh... There's so many places that I do like to visit, but a place where I would like to go is... Um... The UK, so I can meet Ryu and a bunch of other mates that I've met up there. Even America, I can like go and meet other people there that I've also met in VR chat. So yeah, probably, I don't know, I would like to travel the world to meet as many people that, yeah. Is Australian politics interesting at all? Um, well, I don't like getting political on my videos, but if you do want to check out Australian politics, I do suggest th this. Fuck. <laughs> Here you go. Friendly Geordies. He does amazing videos on how politics works in Australia and slow-mo, I mean scomo, sorry, fuck, uh, um, yeah, so, fuck, I've dropped my phone. Are we Americans missing out at all on some of the fast food places there that are only in Australia? Actually, we are more missing out. I actually was lucky enough to have my first Carl's Jr couple of months back mostly because it's like one of the only stores that popped up in Australia and yeah there there is actually like I don't even think we have in and out or any other like okay the only fast food restaurants that I really know that are in my hometown is KFC, Macca's and Subway that's all how did you first get into VR chat um so, in 2018, when I got my Vive, I decided to, I don't know, just download VRChat, check it out, and I kind of, when I got into it, I was just like, eh, this is fun and all, and then basically gave up on it for a little bit, and then came back into it, and now, <laughs> now it's pretty much <laughs> my only place where I am. <laughs> Where do you get your supplies of energy and happiness? Why are you so cheery and adorable? Um, 
I've I've got no idea where I get this energy or like I <laughs> Do you know what's funny? I went to bed at like three o'clock last night. <laughs> so yeah, I've got no idea where I get the energy from. It's probably a lot of coffee. Actually, I don't drink coffee. Where do I get the energy from? I've got no idea. I'm sorry. I have one simple question. Mores or paws? I'm not sorry. What is that? Oh! Just looking at these, uh, images that are here. <laughs> nah. <laughs> I'm not answering that question. I don't like that. Do you like anime? If so, what kind of anime would you create? Or show of sorts? Um, okay. What? Mm. Actually, I can answer this one. Um, I did actually start making a, like, this series uh, on Source Filmmaker. It, it didn't end up going to, going to fruition, mostly because time and I don't know how to use SFM. <laughs> um, but I ended up making this se like, trying to, I, I didn't end up finishing the first episode, but I ended up trying to make a series on this guy who gets kidnapped and <laughs> gets uh, one of the uh, the once in a lifetime opportunities of becoming his first Sona. <laughs> Fuck. How did you think of your first Sona design? Okay, so basically, I like the color orange. So I made an orange um, uh, kangaroo, and I added the white chest because I thought that looked neat. And basically. What ended up happening was, I was just like, okay, well now I need the hair. And I've always wanted to dye my hair blue. So I thought, what does blue look like? And I was fucking amazed on how well it looked. So uh, now it's stuck. Do you think I'm from the Illuminati? No. What got, what got me started in the furry fandom? Okay, what really, really got me started was basically... Ooh, I don't know. I guess when I started doing my YouTube channel, because a year before that, I was at school, and one of my friends introduced me to the fandom, and I thought this was fucking sick. And yeah, what when I started my YouTube channel, I guess that's what really got me into it. Any chance you will do other content besides what you're currently uploading? Okay, well, yes. That, that is yes, but I, I want to keep the content that I do now in order to satisfy the people who are watching my videos now, but also satisfying the people who want to see other content. So, uh, yes. The answer is yes, but it's... I'm going to steadily increase the other side and keep the other side on check too. <clears throat> Favorite version of Windows. Okay, well, I know who sent this and I know I'm probably going to be burned at the stake if I don't say Windows 7, so I'm just going to say Windows 10. Do you play Team Fortress 2? If so, what's your favorite class? Scout or Sniper? What are some of your interests slash talents? Okay, well, interests would probably be, like, VR, then there is also IT, cars is a big one, and then oh, there's a bunch of others, and uh, talents, you think I'm talented? I'm not, <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> if you're a kangaroo, how high can you jump? Uh oh I'm gonna fail this. Okay, let's see. Wait! Ah! I'm back. I'm back. I, I, I think. Have you ever been to a furry convention? No, but I want to. This is a clit. Click. Clitch. The fuck is that word? Cliche. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake! This is a cliche question. But do you have any advice for someone who is starting out on YouTube 
specifically somebody with bad social anxiety is scared of showing their face and can't even talk to strangers on VR chat. Okay, well, hmm. the the best way to eliminate the social anxiety will not eliminate, but like the best way to improve your social anxiety is continue to play VR chat and as you get better, even Omegle, Omegle is one of the better options. Oh, well, actually, because some people troll on that. I mean... Okay, well, for the social anxiety, because you kind of really... Mm, oh, this one's a hard one. So, for the social anxiety, I suggest playing VR chat a bit more if that's an option, and then once you you get more confident around other people, uh, you can start like uploading some content. See, the way I started was uh, this. Where did it go? Is it there? No! Ah, fuck! Oh god! Holy shit, mate! Can you... Fuck off! Just go away! Where are you? Where are you? Where's your creepy little fuzzy butt ass? Fucking... Yeah. You, you can tell that my content's gotten better. But I, I do have to say, try and talk. Don't leave empty space like I did. And with that, the way to start is, I guess, be unique. Try to be unique. Start a, like a Discord server so you can start a community. And yeah, that that's all I have. Sorry. What is the worst encounter you've ever had on Omegle? Oh, this one's a doozy. Okay. It's literally... Somebody fucking a dog. Yep. Yep. Have you ever gotten drunk so hard that you don't remember anything from the last night? From last night. Um... That was... Okay. Well, I haven't gotten blackout drunk like that. Uh, but I do have to say that I've gotten so drunk that I hugged a bucket and uh, said, I love you, bucket, like multiple times to it. And uh, here's proof. Do you like anime? Hell yeah. Love Beastars, love BNA, love Initial D. Fucking love anime. Are there many Australian furries? Um, there, I know there is a couple, but I don't know many. What made you a furry? What is your fursona afraid of? Okay, so what made me a furry was basically, I don't know, I just like found a uh, like appreciation for the art and then my friend showed me more of it and then it, it just progressively grew. What is my fursona afraid of? Oh shit, I've actually never thought of it. Because Cain kind of really represents me. So whatever Cain's afraid of, I'm afraid of. Or whatever I'm afraid of, Cain's afraid of. So I guess... Small spiders. Dying alone. I don't really know. Because, I don't know. It, why is it when you, when you, you, like, you know the answer for something, but when you get asked that question, you can't? find the answer for it. <laughs> what is love? I wish I knew. Well, that's all for this episode, ladies and gentlemen. If you liked it, smash that like button, like a bloody legend. Make sure you put that bell on so you can upload. Make sure to leave a comment because I love reading those comments and I'll see you guys later. Um... Bye!